What's up, challengers? Welcome to the gym. My name is Gym Leader Geo, and this is episode eight of our Let's Play of Alpha Sapphire. And if you guys are enjoying this series, definitely show me some love by clicking that like button so I know that you guys are enjoying this content, and I will keep it coming for you guys. Um, so we're gonna we're here on Route 109, and we're going to Slateport. In the last episode, we explored Granite Cave. We got a little bit lost, and we made a new friend in uh, Ellie, the the Abra. So we're gonna. We haven't finished exploring this. We've got a, a, a woman over here who who seems to be talking about children. A little kid here who wants to fight. Uh, looks like there's going to be a lot of trainers out here. Um, a lot more than I would have liked, to be honest. Because uh, I don't want to, like, over-level. Part of the fun of me doing this Let's Play and uh, and boxing Pokemon that die or faint is that, uh, you know, we get, we get to see a lot of different Pokemon. But if I'm just going to, like, power level all these Pokemon to like too high that's no good that's no bueno Zig Zachary Goon is gonna survive that and get hit me with a headbutt fortunately since he's not uh, a choice banded extreme speeding Lanoon I'm actually gonna be okay with that I'm gonna be okay with that one uh, Zig Zachary Goon goes down we defeat this child we're gonna steal his candy money Tuber Ricky's groaning at us and gives us 56 yeah he doesn't get all that much uh, he doesn't have a job, so, you know. Uh, we're gonna get into a fight with this sailor here. Erp, battle with me. He must be drunk. Those sailors, we hear they, they, you know, they drink like sailors, is what we've heard. He's got a wingle, maybe even two of them. We haven't seen very many evolved Pokemon yet, this far in the game, but we're only fighting against level 12 Pokemon, so we got some range to go. He goes for the mist. Look at that. So now I can't lower his stats. That's unfortunate. I'm going to go for a quick attack here. Finish this guy off right right good. Like, real, really, like, right good like. You know what I mean? 138 experience. And Miguel is going to level up again. He's going to be level 21. Uh, Machop. No, I'm going to stay in. And we're going to wing attack this dude to defeat also. Miguel's going to try and level up on us again. I accidentally went for a quick attack here. That's no good. That's no good. He's going to go for the focus energy. Good thing he didn't go for the low sweep. Otherwise, I would have had to switch out. Actually, he could have killed me with that low sweep. I really almost gave myself a real big heart attack there. I do not want to lose Hank right now. Because then I'll be massively underleveled. And I don't grind, guys. I told you guys I don't grind. So... Um... Brolin wants to learn Headbutt. That's a pretty good move to have. That's better than Tackle. So let's do it. Let's get rid of this. Uh, I also can't uh, evolve Brolin until he's learned Spore. So, um, yeah. So we're just going to have to keep this keep this up, guys. Keep it up. Keep it up. No, Miguel, you're not going to evolve. Not on me. Not on us, I should say. You guys are experiencing this with me. You're experiencing this with me. So let's uh, let's keep exploring. This is like such a... We've got two little girls over here. Is this a double battle? Oh, soft sand. What a pleasant little surprise that is. Um, okay. Let's, uh, let's keep going. Is this a battle? It would appear so. It would appear this is a battle. My phone will not stop blowing up. It is abs it's actually exploding for real. It has exploded, it looks like. But that's okay. Um, that's no problem, guys. I am happy as a pelipper. Let's go for a wing attack on this Azuril. I think it'll live, though. We've seen this Azuril is actually surprisingly tanky. And he's gonna, yeah, he's gonna charm me. But I'm pretty sure even at half attack, I'm still going to be able to take this guy out with a wing attack. I'm excited to explore Slateport with you guys. It's going to be fun. I'm pretty sure I'm done on this beach. I hope I'm done on this beach. I don't want to... I don't want to be around here for Ur. Beldum goes to 15. Beldum, I'm, I'm getting almost confident enough to put you in. Hank's level 20. I'm happy with Hank at his current strength. Um... So we're going to do a little, we're going to move around some Mon right now. Uh, let's put, let's put Miguel in spot two. Let's put Beldum in spot one. Chill in spot three. Now let's put Chill in spot two. 
Broloom and Ellie, you're still not quite where I want you to be just yet, but you guys are valuable members of my team. This dude's got a little zigzaggery goon here. And uh, I'm just going to head up in here, head up into the town right now. We're in beautiful Slateport City. Beam from the lighthouse reaches dozens of miles. Dozens. I wonder whether it's light startles any of the Pokemon in the sea. See, people are really considerate of Pokemon in this world. The sea is just too vast. Could the sea have been made by the tears shed by Pokemon? What? What is wrong with you? That is the most depressing shit I've ever heard in my life. Holy garbage. Um, we're not going back down there. That's just going down to the beach. Slateport Market. Unique items found here. Not found anywhere else. Let's have a look at this market. This guy is selling parchment, it looks like. Do you know the TM secret power? <gasps> Please. No. I need to find it first, and then he'll sell me his secret goods. Uh, all these people are selling stuff for houses, but I don't have any housing stuff yet. He's the energy guru. He's... Is he going to sell me all those herbs and stuff? Oh, no, it's just like protein and stuff. Uh, well, I can't afford that right now. I'm not rich. Oh, you're Beldum. Got to put more... Oh, man, he doesn't... Until he loves me, I'm not going to get anything from you. Would you like some fragrant incense? Uh, okay, yeah, what I want is... Pass up water, pass up grass. Keeps away wild Pokemon. That's kind of useful. Um, but what I want... Is luck incense. Yeah, doubles the money I earn. But that's a lot, though. I can't afford that right now. I'm going to get an amulet coin eventually, but I can't afford. Traveling TM shop. What you got for me? Hone claws, thunder wave, struggle bug, and confide. I can't afford them all. Thunder wave is worth having. Let's get thunder wave. While resisting, the user attacks the opposing Pokemon. This lowers the special attack stat of those hit. I don't really use that. Um, none of these are really that good. Thunder Wave's alright. Thunder Wave's good to have. I guess I'll leave it at that. Let's see what I can... Yeah, I'd like to sell some things, please. Uh, let's sell the Paralyze Heal. Uh, let's hold on to Ether and Revive. I have a Protein... And a PP up and six soda pops, which I could sell for 900. That's not that much. Let's go here and let's organize this, shall we? Let's organize it by name and let's sell the uh, let's sell the tiny mushroom. Oh wait, no, because there might be a collector in this game. Let's sell the X attack and let's sell the special X attack. And uh, I still, unfortunately, I still can't afford to buy that luck incense, which I really would have liked to have bought. Uh, what else do we have here? Seafood. And we've got this woman here. Okay. And, um, yeah, I think... I mean, that's like to leave this area. I'm pretty sure we're like, we're done here, I think. The honey pot over here. What's this old lady? Did we talk to this lady? We did. What is this sparkling shit? What? <laughs> oh, it's an Alakazam. It's, it's Mega Alakazam. Are you kidding me? Dude, I almost missed that. I almost left to the north. Oh my word. I mean, I still need to Mega Evolve my Alak or evolve my Alakazam to a Kadabra, or my Abra to a Kadabra, then to an Alakazam. But, um, that's, that's good. Uh, let's keep going. Um, I don't know where I'm going now, so I'm... Hmm, okay, what's this? Pokemon Fan Club, stop blowing up phone. Oh, that's something about... That's sports, that's sports center app on my phone, guys. What's going on in here? This looks like the Pokemon fan club. We've got a, a Doggett right there. That's Doggett. 
Didn't your Pokemon enjoy having items used on them? Mine acted really happily when I gave it some protein. Of course it did. That's the most expensive item you can give a Pokemon. Ahem. I am the chairman of the Pokemon fan club. Being the chairman, I'm naturally the most important. No one could best me when it comes to raising Pokemon. No one. In my contest, my victory is a foregone conclusion. But that would deprive others of the enjoyment. So now, while away... My time examining Pokemon of others, it is marvelous to witness how others have raised Pokemon, their contented faces and properly Pokemon, the kind of loving graces of their trainers, the heart is overwhelmed, there's so much happiness, oh my, excuse me, I seem to have been going on for far too long, please do allow me to examine your Pokemon and see how it's grown, my see, it's not that bad, it's not that good either, you, the trainer, must put more effort into raising this Pokemon, for instance, may I suggest that you give it some more Pokeblocks, wow, you talk so much, buddy, such an incredible amount of talking. Very friendly towards their trainers. Pokemon are sensitive to the feelings of trainers who treat Pokemon love and kind. They become friendly when people become... Okay, so when someone's really happy, I gotta come back here, it looks like. Until then, we are off, I think. Um, I think, yeah. I think we're done here. Let's uh, see what's going on over here. We could heal up our Pokemon, so let's do that right quick. Ah, excuse me. My face is itchy. Um, I don't know what else I do in this town, so let's just kind of let's just kind of hang out and explore. What do you guys think? We can talk to these guys, but nothing ever happens inside here, so I feel like it's a waste of time. So let's keep going. Um, I really would like to. He hiked from Mauville, but boy, this city is huge. If I'd known that, I would have ridden my bike. Yeah, I would have ridden your bike too. We got some Team Aqua here. Is that what? What did he say? Smash hit games. I thought it was like Smash Brothers. Why is there such a long line here? Our boss is scary when he's mad. What is this, Team Aqua? Yeah. Yeah, that's Team Aqua for sure. Um, I'm not really reading all this stuff. Team Aqua has a policy of assembling and dispersing at the operation site. Okay. Why can't we... Hey there, quit pushing. This is a line. Can't you see? Meh. Meh. That is a long line. I agree with you, lady. There's probably an item hidden up here. No? No? Okay. Fine. I didn't need that item anyway. Whatever item it wasn't. That's the store. I don't need that. We're all doing, we're all doing fun. We're all having a good time here. What's going on here? The Fairy SS title is under construction in the shipyard. Service is not expected anytime soon. What is this? The Is this the gym? Is it a shipyard? What is it? I don't know. Oh, this is just where it's going to be. Sorry, but it's not available for service yet. This These guys are just standing here waiting for it to be ready. So I'm not going to wait around with them. I've got, I've got Elite Fours to beat. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing nothing, nothing in this corner. This, they weren't kidding. This is a big town. This is a big town. This is the Pokemon. Ooh, guys, we're going to do some contests. That's going to be next episode for sure. Yeah, he's going to enter. But before, so before he does that, he's going to have to catch some Pokemon. That's going to be hard. Name Raider's house. Okay. This is cool. We got stuff going on. If you want to change your Pokemon's nickname, get the name Raider to help. He lives in this town. Yeah, okay. Good for him. Was this back to the fan club? Okay. So seriously, what am I doing here? Do I have to go north? Norte? Norteños? Where are we? This is Route 110. Did I kind of... Am I done here already? Is this a secret item hidden over here also? Why do we keep having these areas and no hidden stuff? What should I choose? Make a beeline for Marvel on the cycling road or take the low road? I'll take the low road. Or I'll take the high road. You take the low. There, the crevasse. Feel it. Ooh. Guys. There seems to be a Pokemon hiding somewhere, which is a very useless bit of information. Oh my god, no! I did it again, guys. There was a hidden Pokemon there, and I was sprinting around. We, what we have here is a Plusle, so we might as well just catch this guy. Uh, we've still got time. 
We've got plenty of time. I'm gonna hit him with the. I'm gonna hit him with a hold back. He's gonna go for the helping hand, but that's a completely useless thing to go for. Plus one, you're an idiot for doing it. So I'm gonna go for another one. He's gonna encore me. Jokes on you, buddy. I was gonna do that attack again anyway because I don't want to kill you by accident. I'm gonna go for one more. He's gonna go for Spark. He gets the para. And I get fully paired. Well, you know what, then? I'm just gonna catch you because... No, do not use a Great Ball on this little chump. Just a usual... Just a normal Pokeball. Just a normal, everyone loves it Pokeball. I need to, uh... I need to get some money, and I need to buy that... Um... Rich Incense. Because... Money is good. My Encore ended. I didn't catch that guy. I'm gonna hit him with a hold back again. Hopefully I don't get fully parried. He goes for the Helping Hand, which says nothing. I'm fully parried again. What is going on here, guys? This is the kind of crap that got Charles killed. He goes for the Quick Attack. That's gonna be resisted and do exactly one damage. I'm fully... If this happened in one of my Wi-Fi battles, guys, I would have, um... Uh... I would have been very, very aggravated. He goes for the quick attack there. I bring him down to 1 HP. Now I'm going to throw the Pokeball at him, and we're going to call this Bozo a dead, dead Bozo is what we're going to call him. Yeah, you're going to be a dead Bozo. Dead Bozo the Plusel. Caught Bozo the Plusel. Your nickname is going to be Bozo. I'm going to nickname you Bozo. One of the most offensive things you can say about a Pokemon. But let's see what he is in our Pokedex. Uh, he is a male. One foot tall, nine pounds. Yeah, sounds good. We're going to nickname you Bozo. I'm not even sure how you spell Bozo. Does that look alright? Good enough for me. Um, phone continues to blow up. Why do people always want to chat as soon as I'm... Uh, so, you know what? We explored Slateport together. I think that's worthy of a, I think that's worthy of a save. And then I think next episode, we're going to do the... Yeah, I think next episode is going to be us playing in the Pokemon contest together. Because I'm really excited for that, actually. I've missed contests. I still have some Pokemon from Gen 3 in Pokemon X and Y right now. I have them. And... They have all their... I wonder if they have all their ribbons. They're going to be so excited to come back to this. But definitely thanks for watching, guys. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. As always, my name is Jim Leader Geo. You guys are the challengers. Thanks for stopping by, and I'll see you guys next time.